Hey guys, this morning let's practice speaking together before I go have lunch. And our topic for today is that describe a time when you had to make a difficult decision. And you should say what the decision was, when you made it, how long it took to make the decision, and explain why it was it difficult to make. Well, before we begin, I have one tip for you in IELTS speaking. Is that in IELTS speaking, sometimes you don't need to tell the truth. Of course, you still have to tell the right information, not the false information. But what I mean is that, for example, if you stumbled across a topic which you have never experienced, like for example, last time I came across a topic, which is describe a time when you have been to a football match. Well, to be honest, I have never been to any football match, and I have never even watched a full football match before. I do watch some highlights. So I did know a little bit. So it's hard for me to describe my feelings, but I still feel about my feelings, how excited I am, and how like angry I am when our team lose, for example, like that. So sometimes you don't have to tell the truth as long as it makes sense and as long as it's the right information. It's okay. So for this, I can just tell lies and films as long as it is right. Okay. So let's get started. In one, two, and three. I have to say that I've never been good at decision making. Oftentimes, I have to rack my brains, thinking what to do, what not to do, and this often puts me in anger and frustration. Today, I would like to share about a time when I had to decide whether to buy a new phone when I was living under my parents' roof. Well, to be honest, as a kid, when you are still living under your parents' roof, it's difficult to ask for things, especially when your house are on a tight budget. For example, when our house are on a tight budget, it's hard to even buy some essentials for every day. But as my phone is broken, and I really wanted to buy. A new phone. It does not have to be expensive. It does not have to be like modern. It just need to have a phone so I could study and call whenever possible. Well, however, things did not go as planned because it takes me a lot of times to make this decision whether I actually have the courage to go ask my parents, "Can you buy me a new phone?" Because oftentimes my dad he had this believes that whether it's old but it's still usable. Of course, my phone at that time it was still usable and we can still easily use it. But the problem was that it's too hard to even type normal essays and text on the phone, so it's really hard to go and buy one. And after some time, I finally. Find found my courage to go ask my parents, and surprisingly, they agreed. So I think it was difficult because number one, my house was living on a tight budget, and especially we don't even have money to buy some essentials too. But surprisingly, my parents agreed. So at that time, I had found a lot of courage in decision making and how to make the right decision. Okay, the end. So I talk about a time when I had to ask my parent for a phone, which is totally wrong. Cause actually I have this iPad over here, and I don't need a phone. This iPad is like, like an iPad for the entire family to use. So this is not mine. It's just the entire family. So yeah, sometimes you can tell a little lie. It won't hurt anyone as long as right information. It makes sense. Okay. So bye. See you next time.